So in 2022, I spent a week camped up on Mount Emily above La Grande, Oregon, filming some really lovely time-lapse sequences of the clouds and uh, thunderstorm, Milky Way, etc. Well, one day I noticed some very interesting spraying that was going on by aircraft overhead and documented this. And I thought I'd just put this together and share it with everyone because it doesn't seem like anyone looks up anymore. So I made this for you so you could watch it on your phone. <laughs> but seriously, look up. We're being sprayed. Yeah, thanks. Interesting example of invisible aircraft laying down trails in the sky. You don't hear a thing, you don't see a thing, except for this interesting looking cloud they're putting down here, along with all these others in series. But you hear that? That's no jet. They laid all these down without making a sound in a matter of about 20 minutes. And you can see this one here is increasing. <laughs> But you don't hear a plane. Yep. It's a mystery. Here we go again. This guy's land on a fresh one. You can't see a plane. You can't hear a plane. And what is he spraying? Maybe it's vitamins for, for everyone, yeah. They, they, they say on TV that they're going to spray the sky white to save us from the evil global warming monster. Look at that. He missed the spot. Oop. Maybe, maybe he's typing in Morse code. What do you think? Well, you can kind of see something there. He's turning his sprayer on and off now. What kind of jet makes no sound? Oh, did you run out of gas? He's almost directly overhead. You can't hear a thing. I guess he ran out of vitamins. All I hear is the wind in the trees and the traffic from the ground. At least we can see it now. He's directly overhead now. And look at this lovely stripe he left us. Oh, he's gonna do it again, here he goes. Guess he ran out again. I guess it was just a fluke. You just had a little bit left. Meanwhile, this remains. 
Oh, here we go. Here's another one. Here's another one. They're ganging up on us. He's quiet too. They're gonna paint the sky white, baby. Yep. What do you think he's spraying us with? Now here's the other one. This has got to be like five, seven minutes now. It's still just hanging out. Along with the other ones that I filmed. Goodness, got to be 20, 20, 30 minutes now. They're still up there, just hanging out. So here we are. These lines that I filmed nearly an hour ago have wafted down the valley and still remain an hour in the sky. I've spent thousands of hours filming clouds. Clouds do not remain in the sky for minutes. They regenerate. These isn't going nowhere anytime soon, honey. Look at this. Look at this. This is poison, honey. And we're all breathing this. Why? If you've ever really watched clouds, you'll notice that they only last for a few seconds or minutes at most. They dissipate and then they can regenerate. So it's like a flowing motion, but the moisture itself only lasts for a short time. But when you look at the trails they spray in the sky, they can last for hours. That's your first clue. It's not water condensation. <laughs> look at this atrocity. And, and nobody looks up and says, hey, what, what the hell are they doing to us? I wonder why they have respiratory ailments. Yeah. And if you try to tell them, they just scream at you and call you a crazy conspiracy theory. Since before, the sun came up, they have been spraying non-stop this whole sky in the middle of nowhere. And now they've got white out conditions. This is insane and nobody, I seem to be the only one that notices. I know everybody on TV told you that it's a crazy conspiracy theory, but 
maybe when you see it for yourself, you'll start to wonder who's lying to you. The crazy people on the internet or the shiny people on the TV? Yeah, that's up to you to figure it out. But there's plenty of evidence to demonstrate. I just thought I'd share this. Thanks for watching.